Okay, welcome back to my opinion. This is going to be about why the Democrats are so hardcore against Trump. And it's not only the Democrats, it's the Republicans too. And it's real simple. If you just stop and think about it, it's real simple why neither party want him. The Republicans, you think they want him, but they don't. They have to accept him because the American people who voted for him, mostly Republicans and a lot of uh, independents like myself, chose him. So the Republican Party, like Mitch McConnell, does not have a choice, even though they tried in his first election. But here's why neither party want him. He's not the status quo. He's not one of them. He's not... A Republican or a Democrat. He has to identify as a Republican, and in many ways he is one. In some ways he's he's Democrat, he's liberal in some ways. Donald Trump goes against the status quo of the party system, the two party system, the monopoly that they have in this country. There really should be about five different parties, uh, and it should be a requirement. They should be broke up like Monopoly, like they tried to do to Walmart, uh, Bill Clinton tried to do, uh, Microsoft, etc. I don't know if they tried to do that to Walmart or not, but uh, Microsoft definitely. Um, but yeah, a two-party system is a disaster. It's a, it's a recipe for disaster. George Washington was totally, adamantly against the party system. And that's why the Democrats and the Republicans, don't let them fool you, they're full of it too, do not want Donald Trump in. Because he opens the door for independents to start making their way. Once someone like Donald Trump comes in there again and isn't bombarded with all these bullshit charges. He can do things that neither party will do because they're paid for by big industry, big pharma, for example, the hospitals, healthcare, etc., COVID. Donald Trump can do what's best for the country. He He's not a NASCAR with a bunch of stickers, uh, who represents him, like NASCAR. Politicians should do that. Have to wear stickers on who, who bought and paid for them. Just like NASCAR. But anyway, that's the real reason. They know he's not one of them. And they know he's going to bust up the whole monopoly that Republicans and Democrats have. As they should. As we should, the American people. We should not be standing for such an atrocity. The Founding Fathers were of multiple parties, and their parties didn't even really matter that much. Whig parties, etc. But anyway, like, share, and subscribe. That's my opinion about why they hate Donald Trump so much. And think about it. If you really stop and think about it, it makes perfect sense. Like, share, and subscribe. Stay safe, and be safe.